What's up, everybody? It's Zach the Celtics guy reporting from his car. Um, I'm back with another. I'm back with another video, and I wanted to take the time to make this video because I feel like that, at least for the next few days, it's gonna be like the only time I'm gonna have to really discuss anything on this channel because I've been pretty busy lately. And I hope uh, everyone's doing well out there. I hope everyone's getting ready for the spring because I can't wait, definitely can't wait for that. So, oh uh, yeah. So anyway, I uh, also want to give a shout out to uh, my friend Space Voyager 1701. I uh, hope you had a great birthday, bro, and, and I appreciate your support. And I definitely wanted to make this video also because I know that he was saying that he wanted me to make a video with regards to how Killer Creed on his old channel now, on it, no, sorry, on his new channel now, and he is literally more vulnerable and more bitchy and whiny than he's ever been before. And so now his channel, Aussie Tiger, that he's on. He's pulling the same shit. And, and I really didn't have any intention on talking about this, but a couple of my friends, including Space Voyager, told me about how he made a new rant video. And I'll link it in the description, and I'll link it in the, the uh, description here below. So it looks like Killer Creed is more bitchy than ever. He now has a copyright strike on his, or, or some strike on his channel. I don't know if it's a copyright strike or if it's a community strike. I don't know what the fuck it is. I only watched a little bit of the video because there's only so much of that motherfucker that I can take. Be, like, let's be honest. Killer Creed, it's time for you to throw in the fucking towel, okay? It, it, it's literally, you, you're not even doing successful on this channel either. You, all you're doing now is you're just bitching and moaning out your ass about how you're the victim of this, you're the victim of, of all this criticism, you're the victim of everything because you're doing what you always do best. You're playing the fucking victim card and all you're doing is you're just sitting there acting like you're the fucking victim and you're saying how people doxed you, which is kind of funny because you doxed other people so don't don't try to come in here and give us this fucking bullshit that oh I never dogs people I never I never did this I never did that yeah you, you fucking did there there's all kinds of proof of it there's proof on Discord many of my friends on my Discord server have definitely have said that you have doxed people you've also used your subscribers for your own for your own narrative and your own gain. Like, Killer Creed, you're just, you're just a fucking scumbag. Like, you're a fucking lowlife. And you got literally no life whatsoever. Okay, you claim you have this life and you have this... Oh, and by the way, he's making more videos. Now, all these videos that he's putting out, you know what he's doing now? He's still playing videos with those fucking AFL games, Australi um, Australian Football League. He's literally doing those same fucking videos where he gets behind the camera and sits there and bitches and moans about every little fucking thing. So now he's got some strikes on his channel and he said that, oh, if, I, if, if this channel gets taken down, I'm not coming back to YouTube. I specifically remember that quote from the video. Well, good motherfucker, good. Nobody gives a shit. Nobody gives a fuck. Nobody wants you here. Okay? Nobody fucking wants you here. You've burned so many bridges. You've burned so many bridges, and all you've done is pissed people off, is what you've done. All you've done is pissed people off. You literally are just worthless. Okay? Everything that comes out of your mouth is fucking worthless. Because you have no evidence to support any of your claims. Because you say that, like, this person did this to you, this person did that to you. When really, all we were doing was, we were criticizing you for good reason. And what do you do? You sit back and you bitch and moan and claim that that's harassment. These people are stalking me and all this and that. So, do you really think that YouTube is really going to miss this motherfucker? Do you really think that we're going to miss this motherfucker?
Absolutely not. I know for a fact I'm not going to miss him. I know for a fact that Space Voyager isn't going to miss him. And I know for a fact that many of my friends in uh, Space Voyager's group and, uh, and in my group as well with Damien and uh, Kaz, Warfox, and Gage and others, are, and, and my boyfriend Steven, we're definitely not going to miss you, motherfucker. Absolutely not. None of us are going to. Because Killer Creed brings nothing to the table. He appeals to the lowest common denominator, is what he does. And actually, a lot of Killer Creed's fans are children. Are children that he takes advantage of for his own gain on YouTube. He's a fucking lowlife. And then he's like, oh, no, no, my fans are not children. Uh. Yes, they are. There's fucking evidence of it. Gage actually found out evidence. And I've actually had many fans of... Um, former fans of Killer Cream, some like 15, 16, 17 that have came forward um, commenting on my video that I made back in April of last year about how, uh, that very famous video that I made about uh, that I made about Killer Cream. Yeah, um, I've had many come forward saying that he used me for content. He used me for, for all sorts of different things. He's a fucking scumbag. Like he's a fucking scumbag in every way that you can imagine. So no, Killer Creed, we don't give a fuck what you think or what you have to say. I didn't even want to get on here and really talk about this motherfucker anymore. It really brings me no joy to talk about him. But when Space Voyager and a few of my other friends on this website were telling me that Killer Creed made a new video about how he's complaining and because of how vulnerable he is and he's bitching about YouTube and all that. Like, okay, here's the thing. I bitch about YouTube a lot because there's a lot of flaws that go with YouTube. Like, YouTube has a big left-wing bias. They have this fucking bias against, like, smaller creators and whatnot. But Killer Creed is just... What is Killer Creed doing? Killer Creed is just bitching about YouTube because he's mad at what people on YouTube are saying about him. That's really all it is. All it is is it's just... He's just fucking crying wolf. He's just fucking crying wolf. Crying wolf about how much of a fucking victim he is. When he's not a victim. He is a... You are a joke, Killer Creed. You are literally a fucking joke. And I actually said this. I literally had no plans in discussing him. Unless... Unless he said something monumentally retarded. Well, this is one of the things that he has said that is monumentally retarded. That if, that, oh, uh, someone doxxed him and then when he made one of his exposed videos, he got a strike for for harassment. Okay, here's the thing. If, in fact, that is true, which, by the way, I don't believe anything Killer Creed says because he fucking lies out of his ass on a daily basis. So, I take everything Killer Creed says with a grain of salt. If, in fact, someone did dox Killer Creed, I will be one of the first to come out and say that that person is wrong. That is not right. Killer Creed is a fucking scumbag. I can't stand the whiny piece of shit. I, I, I don't like the disingenuous motherfucker. I hate him with every fiber of my being. But it isn't right to dox people. And I don't, and I don't know if that's true or not. I don't know because I don't believe anything Killer Creed says. So it's hard to believe that anything that comes out of Killer Creed's mouth. It's very hard to believe anything that comes out of his mouth. So, yes, I take everything that he says with a grain of salt. So, if in fact that is true, which by the way, Creed, you need to provide some evidence. Which by the way, Killer Creed does not do any, he does not supply any evidence to back up any of his claims. So it's hard to believe anything he says. It's very hard to believe anything he says. So do I believe it? Probably not. I think he's just doing it to bitch and complain. But if in fact that is true, then okay. Then fine, whatever. I will say that that is wrong. That is not right. And I will also say that YouTube's policies on harassment are fucking stupid. Because no, Killer Creed is a scumbag, but he has a right to make exposed videos. As much as I think that his exposed videos are fucking retarded, he has every right to make them. He has every right to make them. I'm sorry, but you can, because but if you're gonna you're gonna say that oh he deserves to be banned. Well, here's the thing. There's a lot of things. I hope Killer Creed fucking leaves for good. I hope that does happen eventually, which I think is gonna happen. I mean, I think Killer Creed's on his last leg. He's pretty much done at this point. But to be fair, if 
if Killer Creed, in fact, did get banned from YouTube, am, am I going to shed a goddamn tear about it? Am I going to say that, that that's an injustice? File that one under fuck no at www.whogivesashit.com forward slash Killer Creed can go fuck himself. Okay? So, yeah, as much as I think that, yeah, the uh, Killer Creed getting uh, a strike for harassment, I think it's a little stupid because this is what YouTube does with just about everything. Because YouTube has this fucking bias. And Killer Creed is not a big channel. Yeah, he has 1.2K subscribers. But I'll tell you right now, there's no doubt in my mind that that motherfucker subbots his channel. There was also proof he was doing it with his original Killer Creed channel. So there's no doubt in my mind that he fucking subbots his channel. I have no doubt about that. So yes, Killer Creed, nobody gives a fuck. And I definitely am a hun. But here's the here's the other thing. Killer Creed, it's wrong it's it, it, it is stupid for them to censor him for harassment or give him a strike for harassment. But here's the thing, motherfucker. You brought this on yourself. Okay, if you just shut the fuck up and stop and stopped and stopped being a fucking drama queen and stopped creating drama everywhere you go, you wouldn't be in this fucking predicament. You wouldn't be in the predicament of you wouldn't be in the predicament of you know, oh, uh, getting a fucking uh, strike on your channel. The reason that you got a strike on your channel, it's because. Yeah, it's because YouTube's policy on harassment's fucking stupid. I, 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 I definitely believe that. But the thing about, funny thing about this dumbass is, he pokes a stick in the eye of the tiger, and he expects the tiger to not react. He calls himself Ozzy Tiger. He's not a tiger. Because a tiger is someone that's strong, is someone that is, and like, I'm not saying I'm this big, strong, tough guy either. But is Killer Creed a strong guy? Fuck no. He's a fucking weaselly, whiny little pussy ass punk bitch who thinks he's so fucking tough, but in reality, he's none of those things. So yes, it's stupid for, for YouTube to censor Killer Creed because at the end of the day, as much of a scumbag as he is, he has a right to say whatever the fuck he wants. But I do not feel bad for Killer Creed at all. Fuck that guy. He brought this on himself. Period. Bottom line. So anyway, that's all I gotta say for today. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna cut it here because I'm at my friend's house now, and I thought I would just take the time to make this video and this response because I I did promise a couple people I was gonna make this video on Monday because I actually, to be quite fair, that's literally the only time I have to make any videos at at, at this time. So I just wanted to put this video out now and. And I'll be back with more videos um, and more content on the way. I definitely have more topics to discuss. I'm not going to discuss Killer Creed much anymore unless he does something like this that's monumentally retarded or there's something new about him. I'll discuss it a little bit, but I'm not going to make it a priority on this channel, just like I'm not going to make any one singular thing on this channel a priority because I talk about everything on this channel, not just one thing. So yes, I don't feel bad for Killer Creed at all. He brought this on himself, he made his own bed, and he needs to lay in it. Fuck that guy. Anyway, peace, have a nice day or night. This is Zach the Celtics guy, thank you for watching. And I will be back with more content and more videos and a whole bunch of shit in the works. Stay tuned, bye for now. Have a good day, and I don't feel bad for Killer Creed. He got, he's getting what he deserves. Fuck that guy. Have a nice day, folks.